Welcome back to Let's Play Yakuza 0, Burning Dog fans. We're supposed to be skipping work at the Grand in order to go get beers with Sagawa, but instead we've been roped into helping Koko-chan convince her father that Majima is her boyfriend. I am a Yakuza. <laughs> no, no, I, I can't do it. I'm not going to sink this girl just because it's funny. Now jump up on the table and sing the Steve Martin song from uh, Little Shop of Horrors. It helps put badass as it is for their dentist to also be badass, you see. That wasn't in the thing. I oh, better go for it. Gotta be this one. Ha <laughs> up with a toast one though she found you ran into me while eating toast everyone's throats look kind of weird in this game i have a mouse cursor no fair enough just a weird texture right over where the adam's apple would be Whoa! I just, you know, finally paid attention to what he was actually saying. This would be the part if I used a uh, stand-up mic where I would lean in real close, get all breathy, and make it creepy. She looks amazing in lacy panties. <laughs> Say something about her smile. What, like he's a wizard or something? Okay, that's from the backstory. But it seems to be the worst option here. Oh, fuck it. I am one with the Force, and the Force is with me.
Is this where we like arm wrestle or something? Don't fall in! That's, that's exactly what you say to your girlfriend. Would you like to join me in snorting some cocaine? Beg your pardon? I mean, you gotta, you know... Keep doing that. Is that a bowl of wasabi? Actually, new. I don't know. Mark Hamill? It's only been 11 years since Star Wars. I don't know the years for Empire or uh, Jedi off the top of my head. What? That is not what I was expecting. Just go Majima and the dick. Mm.
<laughs> oh no. The fuck you say? Looks so excited. What? <sighs> oh, man. Okay, so I could have avoided that if I'd gone down here. I wasn't sure if that was like something that was scripted to happen or not. Although that would take me straight past the dragon and tiger. Who the fuck is this? I guess it doesn't say. Can't turn the camera. There's a tree in the way. Oh, for God's sake. Ah! Ah! Well, I mean, I see people, but... Oh, no, there it is. Oh, yes, of course. Can I, like, no, I can't go into them. I thought for sure she was going to come back and have to win a different doll. That reminds me, I have a shitload of money. Yes, please. Oh, fuck, that's really expensive. Hot damn. But only on the second or third heat level. This drink. What? Oh. Oh, shit. I will save up for uh, this, though. No, not this. I acquired that. Uh, what was it? This. Yeah, that sounds great. There you go. I'm finally setting my sights on a specific thing. Never mind that I need 9 million yen to get there. Oh, actually, I wanted to check something. Uh, notebook! Anything new up here? Ha! Ah, Taiga Saijima. A former member of the Sasai family, a Tojo clan affiliate. Hulking in stature, he is sworn brother to Majima. Three years ago, in 1985, he carried out a raid on the U Uino Sewa clan under orders from the Sasai family patriarch. Majima was supposed to have joined him, but was detained on orders from Dojima and Shimano, leaving Saijima to single handedly murder 18 Uino Sewa officers. Immediately after he did, or immediately after the raid, he turned himself into police and presently sits in prison, awaiting what is assuredly capital punishment. Why the fuck did he turn himself in? Huh. Thought for sure that guy was fucking dead. Futoshi Shimano. 
patriarch of the Tojo clan's Shimano family, originally under the Dojima family umbrella, where he and Kazuma served as Dojima's twin pillars. His family was later promoted to a direct Tojo clan subsidiary. I have no idea how Yakuza clan politics work. Aggressive, cruel, calculating, and ambitious, he was Majima's boss until the Ueno Seiwa raid. When Majima ignored his orders and tried to join Seijima, Seijima on the raid, Shimano threw him in the hole, had him tortured for months, and placed him in Sagawa's custody. Fuck. What an asshole. Uh, oh, no, this is Kiryu's friend. Anybody new in here? Are you new? No, I know you. Oh, Oda got a page. Uh, yes, I did look at this. What's in here? Oh, actual hints, that's right. Yeah, I know that. Oh. Oh, it's... Mm. Man, you think I don't know that? I'm a million videos into this fucking playlist. Consume food, drink or food, or need or eat food items, or use recovery items such as stamina and X. Some pagers can send messages, but I guess this isn't one of those. My dad had one like that. He had a, had a little tiny, tiny keypad under that on the side that he hated. You know what? I am curious about drinks with Segawa, so, uh... And then again... Suddenly I'm worried about triggering the next chapter before I, uh, do all the side stories. And I see it's coffee, but... Wait, what? Oh! Maybe next time. Kid's still there. It is the kid who's the thing on the map. Oh, God. Oh, you're alive. My mistake. Sorry about that. Come on, stay down. Sweet dreams. The pummeling bat. I do like that. She didn't even notice. I mean, I just savagely beat several men near you. You might have gotten teeth stuck in your hair. On that last hit. The blue one. I like that. Mm. 
Noted. Oh, you okay, dude? That's better. See, she's barely dressed at all, and she doesn't look cold. As it happens, the timer went just as I did that. There's the statue guy. For a second there, I thought he was dabbing. Where is that damn bar? Uh, hmm. So I'm going to make my way past this big lumbering idiot. Hell. This they're easy to avoid. Oh. I just saved, didn't I? I'm burning dog face. And I'll see you in the next episode of Let's Play Yakuza 0. When I figure out if I want to do these side missions or go after drinks of Sagawa. No, I guess they're pretty good about warning you when you're about to reach the point of no return, aren't they? Fine, we'll go meet Sagawa. Atuna. And there you have it. <laughs> Later!